it's Josie and welcome to today's video vlog. I'm so happy you're here. So this video is about third eye center. Now I've been talking about the third eye and higher intuitive psychic abilities for a long time. If you follow me on my channel. Today I wanted to share with you seven reasons why people cannot quite open or activate the higher intuitive senses what we call the third eye awareness. Now, you know, I am personally very, very interested in this whole subject of psychic intuition, and I've been trying everything. I did deep meditation with specific teachers. I also tried different psychedelic experiences, and I understand what it means to have your third eye open. <laughs> I have experienced that. So that's the only reason why I teach this, because that has been my experience. But I also have seen other people who are not successful with activating their psychic abilities. And here's why. So all of these seven reasons are based on fear, different fears related to their life. So the first fear, fear of change. Many people are afraid to activate these higher perceptions because they feel everything around them will begin to change. So they're just afraid that their friends will not recognize them, that the families will not recognize them, and they would quit their jobs and leave their bad relationships and go in some mountain to pray for the rest of their lives, which is not true. So they're just resisting, even though they may want it, even though they may feel like this would be the most healing experience for them, the most eye-opening experience for them. They're resisting because they don't want to change their lives, their situations. Another reason why people have difficulties opening their third eye is because they're afraid to be possessed by some negative entity. They feel like once they sort of change their state of consciousness, they become vulnerable and all kinds of negative bad energies are just going to be attracted to them, which is again not the case. If you are doing it in the right way, in the right environment, for the right reason, you actually open up to seeing your higher self, your fuller potential. So, but being possessed is one of the most common fears about their psychic abilities. So number three, fear of not being spiritual enough. They feel like, okay, you know, only people like, I don't know, Buddha or prophets or saints, they have these special gifts, special ability to be psychically open, to have the aura, right? The halo around them. So all these psychic visions are open, but I am not spiritual enough. I don't think I can do it. I don't think it's for me. I'm just average. I'm just an ordinary person, mortal. So all of these things are not for me, which is again, not true. Okay, so reason number four, they don't believe in the third eye, right? They don't believe it. They feel like, okay, it's all about their body. It's all about their life here and now. And when this body is over, you know, life is over pretty much. So they don't have awareness about psychic abilities, they don't have belief, they don't have faith in their own supernatural power, and they never try. You know, why bother? So the reason number five why people cannot activate their psychic abilities is because it's not on their priority list. Now, they believe, they understand that they are psychic beings and intuition is their natural gift, but you need to develop it, you need to do all these rituals, you need to do all these kinds of, you know, tapping on the third eye and spending time and chanting and meditating. They don't have the time for that, okay? And it's because it's not on their priority list at all. They have, you know, A, B, C, D, all the to-do list for the day, but psychic abilities, well, you know, if, if this just be like some sort of like magic pill that you can take and your third eye will be open, but it doesn't work like this, so I have to put effort. Uh, nah. So the reason number six, they don't have the right teacher. There are hundreds of different teachings, techniques to open the third eye. You can see all kinds of gurus stepping forward and teaching one and only unique ability. And I believe that they have their own ways of teaching. Don't get me wrong. I have my own ways of teaching this. 
from my own experience, from trying different things. But if you do not have the right teacher, you will be discouraged from trying so many different things. And some of these teachings are contradictory. They just work against each other. So when you get overwhelmed, when you are not guided by someone who understands you, who sees you, who is trying to help you on this path, you will give up because it's hard to do this on your own. So if you don't have the teacher, the guru, the guide during this process, you may be discouraged to work on your psychic abilities. And finally, number seven, what I've noticed is the reason why, even though people try, people do all kinds of techniques, but they're so centered, their awareness is so centered in their physical self that it's really hard for them to break through their own limitations they see the world just through their physical senses and it's difficult for people to switch that awareness from the body into your spirit self it takes time if you do it consciously it takes time it takes practice but some people have these spontaneous experiences right so that happens too all these miracles or if you have some sort of you know ayahuasca experience that also happens very very quickly but for most of us myself included it takes patience it takes practice it takes really awareness shifting the awareness from the body into your spirit self because when you are spirit right you perceive the world differently so you see yourself differently you see your source differently and when you live from the spirit you live from that third eye perspective so and that's how you know you know i'm in the spirit awareness and my third eye is open so here you go guys i hope this information helped you and if you want to share your stories about your third eye opening experiences put them in the comments below and be well and blessed my friends love you with my heart and share with you in the next video